Hey y'all, it's Betsy with Happily Ever After, etc. And welcome back to another Pandora video. So today we're going to be looking at the brand new Year of the Dragon, the Gold Dragon Charm from Pandora's newest release. I am so excited about this charm. As soon as I saw him, I knew I had to have him. You know your girl does not do a lot of gold or red. I only have that on one bracelet. Um, but we're going to Singapore, Vietnam, Asia later this year, and I am picking up some gold charms for that. Eventual bracelet. I have so many plans for what I want my Singapore bracelet to be. Um, and there are some really pretty gold charms from that part of the world that I just, I just can't pass up. So as soon as I saw this dragon come out, I was like, he would be super cute on an Asia themed bracelet. Um, I had to have him. It was hard because the Cinderella release, the Year of the Dragon release, and the Valentine's Day release all came out at the same time and the girl cannot buy just anything she wants. We are on some semblance of a budget that is always shot this time of year with the after Christmas sales and the new releases. So we were I was going to say we were good, but we were not good. <laughs> I was not good. I picked up this dragon and the two Cinderella Muranos from the Cinderella release, along with all of the charms from the after Christmas uh, sale that I had to have. I might have gone back for more charms from the after Christmas sale that y'all haven't seen yet, but I will probably do a new video for those eventually. I'm still waiting for uh, one charm to come from Rula Law. So once that charm comes, we'll do a full look at all the new things I had to have since last time I showed you the new things I had to have like a week ago. In the meantime, let's get right into this new bad boy. He is stunning in person. I just wait, just wait. I was gonna be good. I was gonna wait and just get him in Singapore. But when I went back for that after Christmas sale, take two, had to go check those $15 trays one more time at my local store. They had him in stock right after he released and I just couldn't resist. I'm gonna bring y'all in closer so you can see the detail. All right, so here he is. Look how stunning he is in person. His tail wraps all the way around, not once, but twice. I was telling my mom that he looks a lot like the caterpillar design from the spring collection, the pink one, except just so much more detail. That one's all smooth enamel, whereas this one is the Pandora Shine, so it's the gold plated. And you can see he's got scales on one side and CZs on the other side, which is just, I mean, all the way around. And then look at his little face. I mean, the details, even his little like eyebrow ridge and nose and his mouth is all perfectly detailed. His little tail. You turn them around. You know, I always think my nails are clean until I do these videos. And even the back of his head and his scales, I mean, he's just honestly stunning. Now he's gonna need some support to stay upright. He's definitely top heavy, but that's okay. I think he's just beautiful. Let's look inside. So he is kind of hollow in his head, which makes sense, otherwise he'd be really top heavy. I thought I saw homeworks on them at some point, but maybe I imagined those. I could have swore I saw some. Silly. They are literally right inside uh, when you look straight on. Right there. A L E. I think it's M E T. I mean, why looks like I'm fairly blind, but hopefully y'all can see those. They're right at the bottom of this curve here. 
feel like I need to get like a light shining in there because it's so dark. There we go. This guy is just stunning. And so the only other gold and red Singapore charm I have at the moment is the Lucky Cat. My mom has the Lion. Ooh, I have her box. Let me grab it. Just a second. Okay. Yes, he looks literally perfect with the Asia charms we already have. So the two on the left are mine. The two on the right are mom's, although I honestly, I will probably end up with all of these at some point. I would have gotten, I would have gotten all four for myself, but they only had one each of the little Chinese dragon, the lion, and the cat. So I got the cat and mom got these two. Um, and if I could steal this lion from her, I would, because he's very detailed. Check out that after Christmas sale haul for full looks at all three of those. But the red gems for his eyes, the CZs, the gold, like, would that not be a stunning bracelet? Now, the only downside, of course, is if I let them go, the two dragons flip upside down immediately. But on this dragon, I don't mind it as much because he does have those beautiful scales all the way around. Whereas this guy is just like, feet up in the air. He looks dead. <laughs> oh, so hopefully with some stoppers or Muranos or something next to him, he will stop doing that. But in the meantime, the very beginnings of my Asia themed bracelet you see before you. And I think it's stunning. Stunning, I say. Hope you liked this little look at the Year of the Dragon. Uh, if you got this charm or the, it was a little bag or amulet, I don't remember. Let me know down below if you got either of those two charms or there was a necklace or if you were waiting to get them. Uh, if you go to Asia at some point. Since I am literally scheduled to go to Asia, I could not wait, especially because a lot of the places that we're going over there are not going to be near a lot of Pandora stores. So I think I'm going to have to try to get a lot of the charms online from friends. And uh, this is one less charm I have to spend money on then. So I will see you in the next video. I hope you liked this one. Bye.